In this tutorial, you're going to learn how to install and customize 3DV Countdown module. First thing you want to do is to import the modules into DV library. To do so, go to DV, then DV library. Click import and export button. Select import, then choose file. In this free pack, there are three countdown modules. If you don't need three, all three of them, you can import only one of the modules by selecting respective JSON file. I already imported all three of them, so I won't be doing it again. Also, in the files you downloaded, there is a CSS file that we are going to use in a moment. When you have the modules imported, go to the page and click Add from Library to add the modules to the page. Select the modules you would like. I'm going to select all three of them. Now that we have the modules, we also need to add CSS to the page. Go back to the files you downloaded, open CSS file, copy all the CSS code in it, then go back to the page and click Settings icon. Paste the CSS into custom CSS box and click save. Update the page. Then let's preview. And there we go. Really cool countdown modules. Especially the third one. Really great design. Let me show you how you can customize these modules and change the colors and backgrounds. I will be using Visual Builder for that. With Visual Builder you can simply hover over the element and change it and directly see how it is going to look like on your page. For example, if you want to change this background, you can simply hover over the section, click the section settings go to background tab and tap the image to change it let's for example use this image and as you can see the background image is instantly changed you can also change the text color same way hover over it click module settings then go to design tab and change the title text settings let's choose the white also we can change body text color I'll choose white again besides that you can change numbers color again just hover over it click module settings and go to design tab in this module choose numbers text and change numbers text color save the module and there you go it's exactly the same for any other module as well as the second one here. That's it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching.